Exactly what causes these atrial septal defects is not well known. We believe that this was an abnormality that happened during development when the child was inside the mother's womb. Some atrial septal defects can happen in an acquired fashion, either after trauma or after other surgical intervention, but that's the minority. The vast majority of atrial septal defects are something children are born with, for which we don't have an exact reason or etiology. The symptoms of atrial septal defect vary based on the location and the size of the defect. Usually, children present with shortness of breath or increased sweating or getting more tired when they are playing with their peers, for example. A number of atrial septal defects can be found incidentally very rarely in advanced cases of atrial septal defect, there can be bluish discoloration around the lips and the fingertips indicating that there is a big shunt of blood from the right side to the left side of the heart.